Well, I have to admit, I mean, driving around, you know, you'll be driving on the highway going to different parts and you just see these like majestic, powerful mountains everywhere you look. There's a sense of uh, grounding. You feel very like it's powerful uh, when you're here in Monterey and there's a lot of beautiful people, a lot of beautiful places and definitely the food has been good, the carne asada and all the things. So I'm, I'm going to be learning a little bit more about the, the culture and the food. Um, as I go, but I'm very, very happy to be in Monterey. Very warm people, welcoming and kind. So I, I think relationships, uh, which include emotional connection, but also you know that idea that you actually care for the person, uh, it goes a long way. Before before you teach them as footballers, you got to know about the people. So I've met with all the players and getting to know them every day, creating a nice environment for them, something that they want to be part of. Um, emotional connection for me is just building strong relationships that are built around honesty and trust and integrity. Yeah. Uh, well, it's uh, you know it's my job, so I can speak about it for about an hour or more. Uh, but really, I, I love to dominate possession. I do want the ball, uh, which means that we're going to be very fluid and adaptable when we have it. And when we lose it, I fully expect the team to get it back very quickly. Uh, I want to be a team that presses teams, put them under pressure, uh, but dominating the match, both in and out of possession, but mostly in I adapt to the, the players. Um, I would say I come in with a preference on how I'd like to play, what I believe to be effective. And then when I look at the skill sets, and I'll give you some examples, uh, there's a player like, you know, Fair, Ali Bongo, right? He can finish in the box. So of course, finishing is going to be interesting for us. If you have her on the pitch, you have to play a certain way. If you have Bell and Cruz on the pitch, you can work the pockets so much. One of the most impressive, skillful, technical players that I've seen. Very smart. You play a certain way, you, you got to adapt to the tools you have. Uh, it's, it's, part of my, it's part of my job. I think every coach, every single coach, enters the season with the, the hope, the ambitions, and the desire to put the work in that's going to produce winning results. So I understand there's a winning culture and a winning history here at CBS men and women. But honestly, I think it's about the process and how we get there. So I think that's a pressure, but I don't think it's a pressure because I prepare very diligently to make sure that we put our best in forward every single last year. And we believe that we can And that's why we work together.